friends, we are together virtually to celebrate Palm Sunday, one of the great feast days of the church. It is a day of celebration and a day in which we celebrate the love of God as we return our love to the God who gave us life in love. You know the story. You heard the gospel. Jesus is nearing the holy city of Jerusalem. He sends two disciples ahead to find the colt that has been prearranged for him to ride into the city on the colt. And his disciples then bring the colt to Jesus and gets on it. And to keep the dust down, we're told, they spread their cloaks on the way and they spread their palms in celebration, triumphant arrival of Jesus the Christ, the Son of God. And so we're celebrating a way of love, God's way of love, by preparing the way for the Son of God into Jerusalem, his way of love and our way of love to him, for him. You have been to birthday parties, I bet. You may have had a birthday party given for you. It is an occasion for the girl or the boy whose birthday it is to be celebrated through the affection, the love of friends. That's like what we're doing on Palm Sunday. We're celebrating the love of God that is set forth for us in the life of Jesus Christ here on earth. It is celebration of his love for us and our fellowship with God. It is like a birthday party. And so we join in it as we commemorate our lives dedicated to God. I want to offer a prayer. Let's stand up now. It's time to say together the Nicene Creed, which will come up on your screen. Uh, with me. So you ready? Here we go. We believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all that is seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only Son of God, eternally begotten of the Father, God from God, light from light, true God from true God. <clears throat> begotten, not made, of one being with the Father. Through him all things were made. For us and for our salvation, he came down from heaven by the power of the Holy Spirit. He became incarnate from the Virgin Mary and was made man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. <clears throat> he suffered death and was buried. On the third day, he rose again in accordance with the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. We believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord and giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son. With the Father and Son, he is worshiped and glorified. He has spoken through the prophets. We believe in one holy Catholic and apostolic church. We acknowledge one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. We look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Well done, kids.
Let us pray. Holy and gracious God, you give, we give you thanks for this time and the chance to worship together. We look forward to the time when we can all be together in the choir room once again. Now be with us as we join our parents once again with the prayers of the people for today. In your name we pray. Amen. God's blessings and celebrate Jesus Christ and God on this day for he rides in celebration for you. Amen.